But your, aunt, your question was really a good one because of the fact that what you were, were really asking, even though you don't know it, was <laughs> the question, was the question, why be Jewish at all? Because by being a Jew, you do make a difference between you and other people. And that's the question I was, let someone ask that question, because Rabbi Axelrod, in all the time, refused to answer that question. If indeed there is the great ethical need and goal and drive and imperative is to be a human being, then indeed let us be human beings and you're a thousand percent right. Let's stop this nonsensical Jewishness and go out into the world and stop Brandeis. Let's be human beings. It's a good question. I hope that Rabbi Axrod will answer it. Let me answer your question my way. There's a God, He has the truth, the truth, and He gave it to us. Now that, that doesn't make us racists. A racist is someone who says, I'm better than you and you can never be as good as I. That's blacks, whites saying that. About blacks, blacks saying that. About whites. We Jews say, yes, we have the truth. And we are a chosen people. But any non-Jew who wants to, it's open. Take it and become Jewish. And you can be as good as I am. Torah is truth. And the way to achieve a status of being holy and lofty is through Torah. And that's why the Jew has to be separate, has to be different. And if there's no Torah, then you're right. Then you're right. I can understand you, and I can understand me. And both of us will have great, great trouble understanding Rabbi Axelrod. <laughs> I hope, I hope that someday they won't break, break your heart. And I say they, the non-Jews. Because just as the German Jew was shattered, the Polish Jew was never shattered. The Polish Jew always knew that the Gentile was capable of doing exactly what was happening. He, he, he lived under no illusions. The German Jew was shattered. How could this be happening? I'm a German. I'm a human being. How, how can you do this to me? And the German came and said, you're a Jew. If you won't learn Torah, someday you'll learn it the hard way. So when it... Someday they'll persecute you as a Jew. At least get the benefits of it. Go to a Jewish school. Don't go to Brandon. Go to, go to a Jewish school. Go to a yeshiva. Find out what there is about being Jewish which is special and important, which makes you a, a Jewish and different and separate, and you can be separate and at the same time respect other people. You can be separate, and you can respect them, but know that first you're a Jewish.